You guys are real troopers for watching us pick at our face, literally. to our channel and today's gonna be a different video because we're gonna start this series called buy or buy basically where we like test products for the first time and then at the end we tell you if we're gonna if we will buy them or we're just like buy. buy we like trying out stuff and then kind of sharing our opinion on it so it's a good way to share with you guys mm -hmm. with this kind of this kind of series so today we're gonna do the um, modeling masks or they call it rubber masks mm -hmm. but um, they call it modeling masks in Korea it's yeah, like Korea, Korea yeah trend. it's a Korean beauty trend called modeling masks but um, around here they call it rubber mask because when you put it on your face, it's it like dries into like a rubby, mm -hmm. rubbery consistency. So yeah, um, I have the lavender and the tea tree one, and I have the vitamin C one. They're on this site called GlowRecipe.com, and they come in different um, with different ingredients. It's like I have the tea tree, lavender, vitamin C. They have charcoal, oh, yeah, they have, um, a whole bunch of them that caters to like your skin needs. And you know we love masks. So. Yeah. We do sheet masks, we do clay masks, and we have them in our bathroom right now. We're like mask junkies, so, so we're excited to try yeah, these. Yeah, we saw these, we were like, yes. Because a lot of people are actually talking about them now. Yeah. So we we're like, oh, why don't we try them? The difference between them and the regular masks that we use is they come in a powder, powdery form at first. So you have like this little kit, it comes with a little spatula that you'll see. And you just put water in it, and then you mix it, and it comes with, it becomes with this paste. Mm -hmm. So you gotta quickly mix it and then put it on your face. It's a quick turnaround time for that. Yeah, you just rub it over, put it all over your face, and you let it dry into like this really rubbery consistency. And then after ten minutes, you just like peel, peel it, it off. It's supposed to like mold to your face and mm -hmm. like, and it's supposed to get tight and stuff because yeah, that's the nutrients working. And they say it's better than sheet masks because they say with a rubber mask, apparently the nutrients kind of sets to your skin mm -hmm. better. But yeah, so we'll like see. It. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this. Alright guys, time's up. The moment of truth. We're peeling this thing off. We can't feel our face. Can we peel it off in one go? <laughs> it feels very rubbery, so it's yeah, definitely oh not gosh. like any other mask I've ever tried. I know, it dries so quick into rubber. <laughs> oh, it's peeling. There's some people that can peel the whole thing off in one go. It's like our first try, so yeah. Oh, got a chunk off right here. Alright, so it's all off our face. Oh, face. We gotta have a little help from <laughs> our dear friend Mr. Water. <laughs> um, so now it comes down to it. Is. Would you buy or, or would you buy? Say buy? Um, it depends. Now, first of all, um this little package right here is six bucks. Um, and I thought you could use it for one person, but you can actually use it for mm -hmm. two. So if you want yeah. So you can't use it two uses. Once you pour the water in there, you have to throw it away. So if you have a friend you're sharing it with, mm -hmm. it'll be ideal, but if you're just by yourself mm -hmm. at night, then um, you're just kind of wasting a bucket. Or yeah, bucks. and um, usually for most masks to be effective, so you have to be effective, you have to use them for like twice a week. So 
she does have a three for 15 option on her side. Yeah, I like that. Mm -hmm. but it's not, to me, it's just not practical for me who using a drugstore mask. However, I do like the way it felt on my skin. Yes. Oh my goodness, I can't stop touching yeah, my face. I didn't face, use lotion. Tell. Yeah, I didn't use lotion afterwards. It's not that hydrating like people made mm -hmm. it out to be like, oh, you don't have to drink water. Yeah, you do. It's not that hydrating. Yeah. But it your is skin like, does have a smoother feel to it from what it had before. Yeah, and I. It looks a little bit brighter. I have the vitamin C one. I yeah. would suggest you peeling it off over your sink. Um, do not. I would maybe do it over a trash can or something. It's mm -hmm. just it's kind of messy. Usually with the other mask, you can just wash it off with water. This you have to peel it off. It comes off in little pieces. Obviously, we probably didn't do it right. Like I wish Ava was in stores. Like you said, you gotta pay for shipping and all mm -hmm. that stuff. But it's they're really good mask. Like once you get the hang of it, you can peel it off in one go. Yeah. Um, they're just different variables of why I wouldn't buy it. Um, just the price and the fact that you said it's not in stores and then the mm -hmm. little container. The container, yeah. Like you throw this thing away. This thing was 12 bucks. So maybe if it came in like a bigger jar, maybe I can get more bang for my buck, I guess. I'm not saying bye. bye. As in, see ya. I'm not saying bye because it doesn't work. I'm saying bye because it's, it's not practical with practical. Investment. Yeah, not, yeah, investment. Hey, if you want to try it, by all means, go ahead. It does mm -hmm. work. I would say if you're doing, going to use this, Put it on your face for 10 minutes. Don't do it full 15 because full 15 is going to get kind of crusty. 10 minutes, it'll be a rubbery, still kind of moist consistency, so you can still like peel it off and everything. And because you leave it on too long, the the it won't really work that well. I think we left it on for 15 minutes yeah. and everything. That's why it was kind of peeling off in chunks, but it works. It does everything it says it does. It's just, it's just not that investment. In it. Yeah. Six bucks or twelve bucks for this thing. The shipping is just killing me. Yeah. If they had it in the stores, I would buy it. So, but right now, no. Bye. <laughs> All right, y'all. So that's it for our first episode of Buy or Buy. And stay tuned for stay more. Tuned for more, because um, we have a lot more coming up. Yeah. Stuff for hair and all that stuff. And let us know if you guys are, like have tried the rubber mask mm -hmm. and stuff. And what do you think? And or if you try you... any mask, what yeah. other mask have you tried? Because, like I said, we're mask freaks, and we heard about rubber masks. We were like, oh, gung ho about it. So. Let us know, and we will see you in the next video. Bye.